With Jey Uso, you have to remember, we're looking at a tag team specialist who's really made a name for himself as a singles competitor as of late. Defying his family's wishes, carving out a path for himself as just Jey. He has truly been a delight to watch grow as a competitor these days. And he's taken on one of the fiercest competitors to cross the pond, J.D. McDonough. Part of what makes J.D. so fierce is his ability to adapt his game plan on the fly. Sure, he comes in with a game plan, but sometimes plans change. And J.D. knows how to change with them. That sort of adaptability is hard to learn, but J.D.'s a master student of the game. He's getting a little batter now. Attacks like that one will continue to get Jay his respect. Oh, 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 what a Samoan drop! No! Oh, just completely off target there! That was an absolutely haphazard, uncalculated risk. And I have no doubt they're going to pay dearly for it. There it is, the people's punch! The suplex! Something that I think could make the difference for Jey Uso tonight is his furious speed. Jey thrives when he's at a faster pace that takes full. Great trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? Abdominal stretch. It's how oh, you escape the abdominal stretch. Like that. Oh. Consecutive attacks keeping McDonough off his game. Jey's really putting his furious speed to work here. He's putting himself in the driver's seat thus far. Ooh. There it is, the people's punch. Punch right in the head. The body. Close lined over the top, all the way to the floor. Oh, yeah. Now. Oh, so crazy. Risking it all and able to connect like a homing missile. And he tosses it back in now. McDonough dodges. Oh, gets cracked by the overhand. An impressive sequence from Jay. JD's got to find his spot and take advantage. He had it scouted. Great reaction from JD. Now he's looking for some momentum. Yeah, but McDonough needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. Ireland's ball from JD. Scary, just how dangerous J.D. McDonough really is. Even I thought that was pretty gruesome. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Oh, my God. Superhuman power. Jey Uso fading fast. Takes a lot of power to break that up. Conscious. Main event, Jey Uso with a close call right there. Here we go. Cross body to the floor. Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke and it pays off. Run out of ringside and back to the mat. Oof. He must have seen that coming. Oh, kick to the face. Able to avoid any harm there. Corey, that was a shining wizard. And now JD is playing to the crowd. With the reversal. Oh, kick right in the face. More attacks to the neck area. Not a pretty sight to witness. And JD gets out of the way. Into the neck breaker. Beautiful. There's that mean streak of Jays coming into play. Fueling Uso's furious offense. Oh, what a big to the face. Kicked in the face. And you can see the anguish coming through. Usually the adrenaline of competing masks how hurt you really are, but the pain must be really manifesting itself. Oh, oh man. He steers clear of contact. And JD gets that turn back on him. 
Going counter for counter. Now, can it be capitalized on? Ireland's call for McDonough. That's got to be it. He didn't even let the ref start the count. So well matched. These men aren't giving up any ground. Showing their strength of will, their refusal to... for a belly-to-back suplex. Back suplex into the neck breaker. And this has got to be it! Jamie Russo for the win. 